Here you can see what happens when you press on the tip of the artificial nail, which is what you want to do to make sure it's flush with the tip of your real nail. The rear of the artificial nail flips upward. And that's a problem because the uh, if you do a rosciato or any kind of strum, uh, that's going to get caught on the strings. I'll show you what I mean. With that gap at the back of the artificial nail, if I do rosciatos, there's a danger, just like that, of getting caught on the string. With the transport tape placed at the rear of the artificial nail, that produces, uh, provides a smooth transition for the string to travel from behind the nail onto the nail and off during a rosciato or any kind of strum. So the string starts behind that nail, travels onto the nail smoothly, and leaves the nail smoothly. No problems.